Hi everyone, this is Tanner here. So I was you know, about to work on some new videos and stuff. Wearing my Surfisher shirt. Great band, by the way. And then I see this. The cast for the animated Super Mario Bros. movie is released. Uh, it's, it's, uh, it's something. Uh, there's a lot of really shocking stuff here. I want to break this down. Not overreact, because some of this I'm like, okay, this is really not that great. Some of it, though, I do like a bit more. So let's start here with the main one, Chris Pratt as Mario. Um, to be honest, I don't think this will be that terrible. The only reason I don't like it is that I don't think Chris Pratt can do the voice of Mario. That's the only thing I'm concerned about. I think personality-wise, Mario's a likable hero who has charm to him, you know, um, you see Chris Pratt as Star Wars, he can, and, you know, Owen from Jurassic World, he can be a very likable hero, and maybe the whole thing about this movie is that, you know, Mario's maybe not doing so well and he has to pick himself up, you know, he can play a goofy character like Andy from, from Parks and Rec, but I just don't see him doing the voice, that's the thing that kind of is weird, because you have Charles Martinet as cameo, cameoing in this movie, so Chris Pratt, like, if you were to cast someone else, he would not have been my first choice. I saw a lot of fan casting about Oscar Isaac and Adam Driver as Mario and Luigi. I think that have been great. Like, Chris Pratt, he's very likable. I think the personality traits fit Mario, but I just don't know about the voice itself. We'll see, though. I think this could be a shocking casting. Anna Tara Joy, I think, is actually perfect as Peach. Um, I saw her in some SNL stuff. She's pretty funny. I feel like that's a really great casting choice. She has a really good personality about her that I think will really fit. Um, also, shout out to the boy, Iron Smasher1024. But yeah, I like that. Nothing else to really say. I think that's great. Charlie Day as Luigi, I think, could work. Charlie Day, I haven't seen him in a ton of stuff, but he has this kind of... I feel like he can have this kind of scared but timid, but hey, let's go personality. I really, I like that. I really like that. So, first of all... With these three, I like two out of three. Jack Black as Bowser, ugh. No, I don't know. Jack Black is insanely talented. I find him playing a lot of stuff. Um, but for me, I just don't feel like that he is someone that can portray Bowser. When I first kind of hear it, I feel like that Jack Black is someone who's way too goofy. Um, but it depends what they do want to do with Bowser, right? We don't know the plot of this film, so just based off the casting, I don't know. I feel like that, I'm just someone who I feel like, I, I, I had Idris Elba's fan casting for this, but if you were to get, like, someone else, like, I would be fine with that, um, someone a bit more intimidating. I don't think Jack Black brings that to the role of Bowser. We'll see, though, like... He plays very likable characters, like Poe from Kung Fu Pan is very likable. You know, a lot of his roles, he's a very likable character, and Bowser's supposed to be a villain. King and Michael Key as Toad. Um, I remember when the Mario movie was first announced, I thought they would get, like, you know, celebrity voice actors to have Toad. Um, I think that's great. King and Michael Key is very funny, so I like that. Uh, I'm glad that Donkey Kong and Kraken King Kong are in this movie, by the way. Um, that's something I do want to say. I do like how we're getting Spike as well, K-Mick, that's cool. Seth Rogen as Donkey Kong, I actually think is perfect the more I think about it. You know, I feel like that Seth Rogen sometimes gets stereotyped and just says, Hey, a wacky guy, and he's, I don't know, I feel like he's a pretty nice guy. He can be pretty good at acting. I feel like that... He could be pretty great as Donkey Kong. I feel like his voice kind of sounds like him. Like, hey, you know, I, I don't. I really like that um, casting. To be honest, I, I feel like that Seth Rogen, you know, is funny. He brings all that good comedic stuff. He's done a lot of variety of comedy, so I really like that. To be honest, I feel like that him voicing. Uh, yeah, this is animated, by the way. Yeah, voicing Donkey Kong is great. Fred Armisen as Cranky Kong. I like. Fred Armerson is insanely talented. Uh, he's on SNL. He can play a lot of roles. He's someone who kind of is just a chameleon with acting because, like, he can fit any role. Um, I think Cranky Kong being in this film will be a nice touch. He can play, like, the old Cranky Man really well. 
So, so yeah, I, I like that. I'm glad Cranky Kong's in this movie. Kevin Michael Richardson, I don't really know who that is, to be honest. But I'm happy Kamek's in the movie. Um, okay. Oh, okay. He's in the Cleveland show, Invincible. Avatar. Okay. Let's see who he plays. This could be pretty good. Oh, okay. Oh, he played the Joker in that one animated Batman. Oh, okay. I actually like... Oh, oh, he played that guy in Madagascar. Okay. Okay. I like that. That's pretty great, actually. All right. That, I actually really like him as Kamek. I feel like that, that's going to be pretty good. All right. Um, Sebastian Minusculo as Spike. Spike um, is the kind of boss of Mario and Luigi. Since Mario and Luigi are plumbers. It's not Spike the enemy. I don't believe so. It's like, he's like a retro character, but good casting. So overall, I kind of, I, I do like this. People I know are going to really not be happy with Charles Montanay having surprise cameos, right? I know that's something that people are not going to like. But for me, they're going in a different direction, bringing celebrity voice actors. And I think for the most part, for the most part, that they got it down pretty well. I really like Anna Taylor-Joy as Peach, Charlie Day as Luigi, uh, Keegan-Michael Keogh as Toad, Seth Rogen as Donkey Kong, Fred Armisen as Cranky Kong, Kevin Michael Richardson as Kamek, and Sebastian Minusculo as Spike. Chris Pratt as Mario and Jack Black as Bowser. I'm a bit iffy, but I will say this. Those two have been going at it, and Chris Pratt and Jack Black have very similar styles of humor, so this could have worked. Again, we don't know that much about the movie, but basic cast list, I mean, this is going to be something. It comes out next holidays, which is a long ways away, but yeah, I trust Nintendo with this ultimately. It's, it's definitely interesting news, and yeah, but everyone now do let me all think of this. Until then, take care and have a good one. Bye-bye.